Popped up in Carnacion Strand. Spilling into the rolled up tarp and he makes the play. What a glove by Christian Encarnacion Strand. I think he just he just mouthed an owl. That's a great play right there. Navigating that tarp. Got to get there. And he gives up the body. And yes, he did make that play. Great play. Well, for two of the walk today. Line to right field. That will be a fair ball. That's going to find the corner. Otani flying around third base. He will head home. Correa fires to the plate to catch the tag. Not in time. For now, Otani is called safe. It looked like Vasquez had that glove down. It's a 3 3 game for now. And Twins fans are pumping their right arm. I think just took an unfavorable kick, hit off that divider in between the pads and went towards the line. But Correa, tremendous arm strength, perfect feed. And this should be a quick review. Here we go. After a few, the call on the field is overturned. The runners. Simply platinum. Correa with a strike. Call overturned. Twins by one. Red Sox designated a hitter. Yoshida broken back. Ground ball to second. Here's your first chance, Jackson. Holiday, and you aced it. He wanted to improve turning double plays. He just turned a double play. His first bit of major league action and his first big league at bat will be in the third inning when we return to Boston. And I mean, roll it, boys, and they rolled that one up perfectly. In the final game, Twins have the Dodgers. Bets to left, hit hard on a line. On the warning check, jumping up is Margot. Ball just had a little bit of top spin on it. It was a breaking ball. Still hit 104 miles an hour. It's just hitting just off center, just more the top half of the baseball when you make contact there. To and you pop off the bag. Right. Ground ball to third. Oh. Diving stop. Alec Ball with mud on his chest. He throws on one hop, and it's in time to get Jordan Walker. Now the side is retired 5 3 on the put out. The Cardinals will take a look at this great reaction from Baum and a little skid off the grass to get him. Looper trouble Polo go get it. Yeah. What a play. <laughs> or hey Polanco. The two programs were Bash and cheers. It's hard to get those. Hold on, this redirected uh, with a bare hand. Out at first, not even close. One, six, three, and put a star next to it for Tovar. One of my favorite plays that shortstops can make is the redirected, change your body, and use your hand. Brandon Crawford with the Giants is probably as good as anybody I've seen in recent memory. And this play. It's almost a, it's a palm ball. He's just redirecting the baseball after it gets in his hand. Him over your six years here. Yeah, he. Uh, uh -oh. Ryan Damn. skies one. See if Damn. it can stay in the yard. Hey. Oh, a catch, hey. Lourdes Gurriel Jr. Oh my, up against the wall. How about that? It wow. stayed in there just enough. Which never happens here, right? <laughs> Um, but yeah, I was I was pretty honored. He he mentioned something similar to me in the clubhouse when he came up. You know, after that, when we stand there and, and you know shake everybody's hands, give everybody a high five when they come in, say good job. Um, and he mentioned something like that to me privately. Uh, felt I was honored. I, it meant a lot to me. We've been through some stuff. Um, obviously, being here through 19. Wearing a jacket. Bouncing ball toward the hole, cut off by Rogers. He'll get the out at first. Nobody more pumped up 
behind the play than Austin Gomber. What a beautiful play by the gold glover, Brendan Rodgers. This is a towering pop-up to shallow right. Tolia is still moving, and he made the catch. Corey, you're down there. Yeah. I, is it wind? I mean, he was. No, it just, the ball died. It, it, there's no wind. There's nothing going on because I didn't expect it to end up in foul territory. Totally had a long 30 to 40 yard run. You could tell by Monty, even he did a little course correction. The ball just ran out of steam. Great sliding catch by Tolia, keeping his eyes on the ball, getting the glove underneath it. 186 on the road. Mm -hmm. Ground ball, shortstop, diving stop. Wow. Caballero makes the play, got him. Picked himself up and threw a strike to first to get Sano. And the inning is over, no runs. One hit and a man left on base. Nicely done by Caballero out there at shortstop. Four, nothing raised. And a ground ball. Oh, what a stop right there. And the long throw, and what a pick at first by Yandy Diaz. Caballero making the stop at short, and Diaz making that pick up at first. Boy, put a couple stars on each one of those plays to get the final out here in the bottom of the fourth inning. Uh, you know, Jose Caballero, I, I've not seen a guy get rid of a ball quicker as he goes to the ground, and then how about Yandy Diaz bailing him out on the throw? 4 1 Rays. And a fly ball short center coming in in a hurry. Siri, he gets there and makes the catch. Jose Siri taking care of that one in shallow center field. No runs a hit, a man left. We'll take another look at Siri coming in to make that grab. It's 4 0 Rays. Throw to first in time. Cinder picks off Palacios. That is footwork, Simber. And a quick tag by Drury. Oh, that time he got him. They keep trying, you'll get him. Bobby has exceptionally quick feet. And he picks him off. The White Sox are checking. They will not challenge. Freelich to right. Benson has to extend and tracks it down. Hard to do with Wade Miley coming at you in three seconds. 3-2, three, hit to first. It's a backhanded stab by Bowers. Race to the bag, and Bowers wins it. He has flashed some serious leather the first ten games of the season. I'm telling you what, what a play by Jake Bowers. Just the reaction play. This ball was absolutely scorched right here by Will Benson. He's hit some balls hard in this series, and Jake Bowers steals a hit from him. Probably going to be a double, barrels it up, goes to the backhand and gloves it and then beats Will Benson to the bag.